As far as I'm concerned, I don't work because I get to do what I love every day, and that's be around the sport of soccer and put smiles on people's faces when they come out to the Phoenix Rising matches. In 2020, our club went through one of the most challenging moments in our history. There was an incident that took place on the field in the heat of competition that was, was out of line and it wasn't reflective of our entire organization. So we took that moment and we used that moment to learn and grow. And in order to grow, we needed members of the community to assist us and we worked with one community and on our home opener on, in 2021, is when we signed the Unity Pledge with the other organization that was involved in the incident. And it was our way of, of showing the community, showing our fans that were in attendance, how important this cause, how important our growth, how important our club could learn from this moment and also be a better influence and a better representation of our entire community. And as an extension of that moment, inclusivity became one of our core values at our organization and to this day, it's not just about one event a year, it's throughout the entire calendar year. Considering that Arizona has the largest unity pledge in the entire country, it's something I'm proud of as an Arizonan, and I think we should all be proud of. I'm proud to, to be a member of an organization that's a part of one community, and, and I would love more organizations to get behind this, and I think um, being an advocate shows um, everyone that it's, it's okay to be you. It was important for our club to partner on the Your Vote is Your Voice campaign. It was easy for us to, to get behind the messaging and we're in a unique position as a club so we have a strong social media presence. So for us to be a part of a campaign that, that uh, supports an initiative that is so near and dear to our organization, it was, it was easy for us. My dream for Arizona is that it's a place that continues to grow and evolve I have three young children. The, the world that they have to navigate, especially with social media, can be a challenging world. And I want this to be a place where they don't have to navigate this challenging life on their own. I want this to be a place where everyone is welcome. Everyone feels that they can be themselves. We've been fortunate as a club to lift a lot of trophies. But this award is, is really important to me personally and to our club because I think it's reflective of what we want our organization to represent. Other people in the community have recognized we're an organization that is committed to upholding the values of inclusivity, of accepting, especially for the LGBTQ plus community, a community that's very important to us. And it's something that we've done from that difficult moment and how we've moved forward as a club and I'm very proud of our growth as an organization and, and hopefully we can um, continue to, to impact people on and off the field for years to come.